Hello friends, this is Durga again from IT Varsity, a one-stop shop to learn all the technologies. As part of uh, this topic, we will see how to set up big data environment for practice. Um, so there are multiple ways to set up the uh, big data environment. Um, either you can um, set it up by yourself or you can access uh, the lab, uh, uh, state-of-the-art lab built and managed by IT Varsity. It is called as Big Data Labs or labs.itvarsity.com. And also you can set up uh, uh, environment, a single node uh, VMs on your laptops uh, using Cloudera Quick Start VM or Hotmox Sandbox. And as part of your learning, irrespective of the environment you are using, if you have any questions, we will support. You just have to go to discuss.itversity.com and um, uh, you can raise the topic and we will take care of it. So, um, you can uh, raise the topic in discuss.itversity.com. Now, we will see how to sign up for the lab. If you want to set up the environment using uh, Cloudera Quick Start or Hotmox Sandbox, you can uh, go through these sections and click on these URLs and uh, you will be able to set up the environment. But uh, keep in mind that uh, to set up Cloudera Quick Start VM or Hotmox Sandbox, ideally you need at least 16 GB of RAM. Otherwise, your system will be uh, inconsistent and uh, also it can be counterproductive for you. Make sure you have proper configuration before setting up uh, these things. Now, let us see uh, details about signing up for the lab. Uh, you, you can click on these uh, links, either bigdatalab.com or labs.itvarsity.com and it will take you to this page. And here, you can sign up in multiple ways. You, either you can uh, use Google sign-in, Facebook uh, sign-in or LinkedIn sign-in or you can also do local sign-up. If you want to do local sign-up, you can click on this, uh, give your name and email ID and password. Once you sign up, uh, irrespective of whether you use social sign-up or the local sign up for the first time it will take you to this uh, plans until you buy the subscription okay as of now uh, this is a preview plan for 299 it will be removed and uh, you will see four different plans one for 1495 for 31 days another for 3495 for 93 days and uh, other for 5495 for 185 days and also there is a fourth plan for exclusively for college going students if you are in, uh, 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 if you are college going and if you need access to the lab, uh, until you are in college, we will give it for $74.95, $74.95. Uh, so it, it can be up to two years. If you are an MS student, uh, starting from first day of your first semester, if you sign up for the lab, uh, you will get until the date you, you graduate. And uh, if you are in third semester, you will get only um, uh, for one year. So it depends upon your state. Until you graduate, you will get access for $74.95. And it requires additional uh, proof. We might seek your uh, uh, email ID and, uh, um, uh, and uh, tentative uh, graduation date. And uh, we will uh, 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 give access to you to, uh, up to that um, point. Okay, now, uh, uh, for now, we have only preview mode. Uh, when you click on this, it will take you to the payment gateway. Let me try again. I think there was some issue earlier. That's why it didn't uh, work. Now you can see it took me to payment gateway either you can uh, pay with your paypal account or you can click on pay with the debit or credit card and uh, you can provide the necessary information uh, one caveat is in some of the countries international payments are not uh, uh, allowed by default um, and this company is based out of us at this time and uh, if you are in countries like india and if you if the uh, payment is failing that means your bank is not uh, letting you to make the international payments. You have to follow up with the bank and you have to close the issue. Once that is done, um, uh, you, uh, once the payment is done, 
uh, automatically you will have access to the lab let me make the payment and, uh, and then we will see so once the payment is done it will look like this uh, it will take you to profile page and uh, you uh, a, a, a username will be selected automatically if the username is not available you will see selected username is not available and you have to modify it uh, to make it a unique name and then you can click on create user once you click on create user it will create um, uh, account for you uh, in the lab until then you will not have account to the lab it will take few seconds to create the account now the account is created and uh, it will take you to lab page it will redirect you to lab page where you have the user id password in a button uh, you just have to click on this which will uh, copy the password to buffer and then you can click on this open console I, uh, button which will take you to the web based uh, linux terminal sometimes this will not come up in the first attempt you just have to close it and uh, uh, retry it and it will work now see it it, it work don't worry if, if it is uh, uh, getting uh, tedious to you you can use putty or ssh terminal also now i am launching ssh terminal i am using mac so terminal is available in the mac if it is windows you have to use putty and uh, the username is whatever is there over there and uh, host name you have to give this host name so username at the rate the host name which is gw01.itversity.com and hit enter it will prompt for the password you can paste the password over here if it is putty you have to just right click and it will paste the password or you can use shift insert also in web console if it is windows as well uh, you have to do the same thing sorry now you have to type the username here and then paste the password in mac you have to use command v it, it got timed out let me try again type the username in mac you have to use command v again in windows you, it's better to use shift insert to paste the password which is copied by clicking on copy password and now you are in the lab and now from here we will see how to um, uh, use this lab to explore um, technologies uh, in separate videos as part of this video we just sign up and we are making sure we are able to get into the lab okay so that being said i hope you are enjoying the content of the um, course if you like it and if you think it is uh, meaningful for others please share uh, in our uh, social networking platforms either google facebook twitter or linkedin and uh, uh, it will help me to get some traction that being said thank you bye